I have a special talent to find absolutely crazy locations. Come here. Hey friends, here is camera girl Helena with my cool lighting setup by Nonlight. I am in unusual location today. It is old burnt barn, which I found in one of the city squatters. This could seem total rubbish for someone, but not for me, because I believe a real artist could turn anything into something atmospheric and beautiful. My inspiration for today is Andrei Tarkovsky and his movie Stalker. Tarkovsky is one of the greatest directors of all times, and his cinematography inspired so many filmmakers all around the world. And of course, me too. So let's try to create a few beautiful shots right here with help of Nunlight. I will use seven sources, but before I start to adjust them, I want to use some water to create a puddle and after rain effect, which I will make a little bit later, falling water drops on the surface of puddle will give us a great dramatic look. We need to show that the world doesn't end behind our barn. That's why I use two sources of light to light up different trees, bushes and all space behind the barn in general. I make it with help of two FS200 by Nanlight. One I put from the left. The second I put from the right of our barn. Okay, so now uh, look at our puddle. With this control light, it looks as a mirror. I like it. Okay, it's our model's turn. Let's light up them. Forza 300B with big soft box, 120 by Nonlight. Also, I add PowerTube 15X uh, from the right of a guy model to separate him from the background. And the second tube I put on a crane stand over the models. I will use lightning preset on it to our atmosphere of rainy night. I like these tubes because I can control them from my phone. Speed of the lightning, brightness and others. The next source is for the 60B. I put it right here to light up a wall of the barn and add some interesting shadow effect with help of Branch and my assistant, who will hold it between the source of light and the wall. And power tube to 30C. Uh, to add lightning effect not only over the models, but to the wall of the barn too. Okay, it's time to check our rain effect. Uh, we make it with help of cheapest materials and a few drops of creativity. I think it looks pretty nice, so Let's continue. All right, let's make a few shots with all this magic. Time to check what we have.
So friends, I hope you like the result and this tutorial was interesting and useful for you. My name is Elena Gutkova, that's all, and till next time.